everybody, it's Lisa Twyla's mom and today is Saturday, February 10th, I believe. Anyway, welcome back to our laundry chit chat. So, how was everyone's Saturday? I hope it went well. It is freezing, freezing here in Missouri. I'm telling you, whew, I went grocery shopping. And all I did was Walmart. I didn't do Aldi's. I didn't do anywhere but Walmart because it was doing that drizzly kind of stuff. And I was in there for maybe an hour, hour and a half. And um, by the time I got out of there, I had to use an ice scraper on my windows. Yeah, it was nuts. It was nuts, I tell you. Oh. I couldn't believe that just that little bit of time, it was kind of spitting some stuff, you know, um, like, um, well, what would you call it, sleety kind of stuff, kind of a sleet type stuff, and I got out of there and it was still doing the same thing, but a lot heavier, so I had to scrape my windows at Walmart, I've never had to do that. <laughs> But anyway, got home and everything, um, looked at my temperature on my car on the way back home, 18 degrees and it was 3 o'clock in the afternoon, yeah, so it's cold here and I bet you it has dropped, oh, probably... 10 degrees since then and it's seven o'clock here right now so whew, we're getting a cold cold day you'll have to let me know down below what your weather has been like for the day um let's see twyla's feeling a lot better the tamiflu really has helped her um no side effects she had that one day, the first day she took it, where she was throwing up and uh, had some stomach issues, but I'm be I don't think that was the Tamiflu. I think that was just from her being sick. And uh, But she is feeling much, much better. Uh, let's see. I think she'll be able to do school on Monday. She hasn't ran a fever um, since Thursday night, yeah, so I think she might be able to do school on Monday. Um, she's still tired and worn out and everything, but that's to be expected. She was a pretty sick kid. Oh, uh, let's see, what else? Cleaned my house today. I just did my normal weekend stuff. I scrubbed the bathrooms. I uh, mopped the floors. Dusted the living room. Hmm. Yeah. I don't do a whole lot of housework on the weekends because I, I do a lot through the week. Uh, let's see. What else hmm I don't think there's a whole lot else that's went on today um, got the cat a new bed because we bought Sydney oh she's a big dog so we don't I don't know if you'd call it a bed bed but it's one of those like soft mats for big dogs you know we got her one of those for Christmas, and the cat kind of was taking it over. Yeah, the cat. And Sydney will not get the cat off. She won't chase the cat off her bed. So since Christmas, we've kind of been shooing the cat for the dog to get on her own bed. Well... I just decided, you know what, I'm going to 
get that cat her own bed. And I found a small little pet bed. It isn't necessarily for cats. It can be for dogs, too. But they were only $5.47 at Walmart. And um, it's got the raised sides so that they, you know, have it all around them. And, you know, the padding on the bottom and stuff. So, and she likes it. She's in it right now. So that was a good purchase. And um, I wanted to make you guys aware, at Walmart, if you guys are um, have any little ones in your family, that <laughs> you need to pick up Christmas presents for or birthday presents, check their toy aisle. Their toy department has got a lot of nice things on clearance right now. So, if you have kids to buy for, and you're like me, you try to buy Christmas all year long, and birthdays and stuff, go and check it out. I bought my nephews, my brother has two little boys, 10 and 7, and I bought them each a game, one of those, um, oh, you know, the Disney cars. Yeah, I bought them each one of those. And um, one of them was $3.50 and one was $4. So I thought that was a great, great deal. Okay, let's see. I'm going to move you guys for a minute. Yeah, so I thought that was a great deal. And their Christmas is bought and paid for. Because, the reason I say it's bought and paid for is because I don't really buy them a whole lot. I just want to buy them a little something. Let them know that Aunt Lisa, you know, is thinking of them and stuff. Okay, I didn't have any laundry to put in the dryer. So, I'm just going to, I've got throw rugs in my washer. So, I'm going to start those up real quick. But... Yeah, if you guys <coughs> are um, wanting to start early on some Christmas or even birthday gifts, go and check Walmart, their toy department. They've got some good buys on some some good toys for Christmas. So, guys, um, yeah, that's really about all that went on today. My housework, my grocery shopping. That was really weird, walking out of Walmart and having to scrape my windows. <laughs> I didn't think I'd been in there that long, but, you know, it was, you know, really odd. And um, that's, that's about it for Saturday here at the house. Um, probably won't do these chats on Sundays because um, I got to get myself a nap and all that stuff to start my work week. But... I hope you all are staying nice and warm and um, staying safe. If you have to drive in this stuff, please be very, very careful. Uh, drive, your, watch your speed and stuff like that. And stay warm, everybody. Stay warm. Wash your hands. You know, that flu. Whew! That flu, it is hard to kick. I'm still crossing my fingers that I don't get it and saying a little prayer that I will stay healthy and my husband will stay healthy because, wow, oh, for us to miss a whole week of work, we would have to jump through hoops with our HR department. Yeah, I would think if you take a note, you know, if you've got a note from the doctor that says you have influenza B, they would tell you, stay home. You know, we want your doctor to tell us when you can come back. But, oh, heck no. You got to do this paperwork. You got to do that paperwork and blah, blah, blah. And, ugh. You're sick anyway. You don't want to deal with all that. So, I'm just saying a little prayer, hoping that me and Scott don't get this. Ugh. Because she was just miserable and I don't want it. <laughs> So, um, I guess I will see you guys for another one of Lisa's Laundry Chit Chats. Yeah, Lisa's Laundry Chit Chats. 
I guess I'll see you guys on Monday. I'm probably going to pre-record our question of the week. I've only got a couple more questions that you guys sent me. Was it October? I think it was October that we started doing where you guys uh, gave me questions to ask everybody. I didn't get to do this past Monday because Twyla was sick and I was trying to you know get her better and all that business and sanitizing the house and everything else so, but I hope you guys understand um, so I'm probably going to pre-record the question of the week and uh, upload that on Monday morning and that's it for for the chit chat the laundry chit chat so don't forget to subscribe everybody and you know Give a thumbs up and leave me a comment. You know I love to hear from each and every one of you. Stay safe and stay warm. And wash your hands. Stay away from that flu. I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.